Qatar has strongly condemned an Israeli minister for storming Al-Aqsa Mosque. Is this a Qatar 2022 legacy? Parents in Peru have named their baby after the World Cup's host nation. Over in Bangladesh, Qatar charity has built 15 schools for orphans. And finally, Cristiano Ronaldo received a hero's welcome at Al Nasr on Tuesday. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Qatar's foreign ministry has condemned Israel's Minister of National Security for storming Al-Aqsa Mosque, a move seen as provocative by Palestinians. In a statement, the Gulf state slammed the minister's move as, quote, a flagrant violation of international law. Minister Itamar ben Gvir was seen at Islam's third holiest site under heavy security, calling for greater Jewish access to the holy site. The United States, Israel's main ally, also said it is deeply concerned by the events and said changes to the status quo of Jerusalem's holy sites are unacceptable. Now, in somewhat remote Remarkable news, parents in Peru who were inspired by the 2022 FIFA World Cup have named their newborn baby Qatar. This is according to the South American nation's national registry. The Peruvian entity also found 267 children named Lionel Messi after Argentina won the World Cup. However, the name Ronaldo tops the list with over 30,000 babies carrying the name. Qatar charity is performing a major role in Bangladesh's education system by building 15 schools for nearly 3,500 students. The schools will provide living and learning spaces for the students, with the institutions having classrooms, dorm rooms, teacher quarters, student dining, and activity areas. And finally, thousands of Saudi fans of the Al Nasr Club clamored into Mersul Park Stadium in Riyadh on Tuesday evening to witness the very first arrival of Cristiano Ronaldo at the club. The 25,000 stadium erupted and welcomed Ronaldo onto the pitch, with the Portuguese superstar donning the club's home colors to the backdrop of fireworks. His two-year contract with the Saudi club makes him the highest paid player in the footballing world. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.